Today we're going to do June favorites for 2017. So and I've got some hair products here that I don't normally have hair products that I show very much, but um, I have mentioned several times on my channel that there is this product that I absolutely love. And when I had long hair, I thought, you know, I, I bought this thing because it was smelling so good, right? It just smelled good. I didn't necessarily see a difference with long hair, but and it's expensive, and I couldn't afford it. And one of the Fritzy family sent this to me. Thank you so much, Sandra. Oh, you can't know how much I enjoy doing my hair with this. This is the Orb Dry Texture Spray that I talk about a lot. <laughs> this stuff, oh my gosh. Okay, if you don't want to buy this, please go wherever they sell this. I don't know where that would be because I've always gotten it online. Um, and she sent it to me from Birchbox, which I didn't know that you could go to Birchbox and buy stuff. I thought that Birchbox was like a subscription box that you had to pay to get stuff. But anyway, this came to me via her from Birchbox. When I opened it up, at first I thought, what? Did I like sleep shop? Did I sign up for Birchbox and didn't know? <laughs> and then I opened it up. I was really confused. I'm like, I did. I sleep shopped. Then I saw her name on the invoice packing slip, and I was like, oh my gosh. Then I went crazy on Snapchat, so Snappily can verify that I was absolutely going bonkers that I had been sent this. Thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. I hope you guys don't think I'm ever asking you to send me things, because I'm not. But when something like this happens, I'm like, ah! What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so anyway, with short hair, texture spray makes all the difference in the world. And I had bought this from when she cut my hair. She was using Kenra products on me. And so I ended up buying the Kenra hairspray, which is one of my favorites. I love this. Um, this is number 18, and it's um, Firm Hold. So I really love this hairspray. I mean, my hair goes nowhere. So... I love the Kenner hairspray, and this is a really nice texture spray, and it's got a very nice smell, but this, <laughs> I love you. Anyway, I was just about to spray this in my face. <laughs> um, here, I'll spray it on you so you can smell it. Now, this stuff is so great. Um, even the packaging of an orb, or orbe, orb, however you say it, even their packaging is just, what? I kept the box. I know, right? <laughs> I just love this product. So yeah, that's in my favorites. Thank you again so much. Okay. And so, gosh, you know what? This is, this video is going to seem like, um, <laughs> stuff people sent me video because <laughs> I got a lot here that people have sent me. So I got this. Now when this had came out, this was the Carly Bible the first one, not the not the new one that just came out, the deluxe one. But when this came out, I can't tell you guys how many times I have stuck this in a cart, pulled it back out, stuck it. I mean, I did it at BH Cosmetics. I did it at Ulta. Just keep putting it in the cart, taking it back out, talking myself out of it. And then one day, my friend Carolyn from Miss Flip Flops and Pearls, um, she sent this to me because I had made a comment on her video, she had on, I mean, her eyes looked spectacular. And I said, what are you wearing? And I actually thought she was wearing um, Viseart. And it turns out, I think she was, was, was wearing that, but she had this on with it. And then I just seen Natalie, hi Natalie and Carolyn. <laughs> I just saw Natalie um, saying the same thing about this palette. It is gorgeous. I don't, um, unfortunately, anything I'm going to talk to you about I don't have on today. This is the Violet Voss Laura Lee palette. But you can get a similar look as this with this palette. And I love this shade here. I've used this one, this one, that one. And then I've used this all over my eyelid and this one. These are actually highlighters, but they look really good as eyeshadows. And I just really, really like this palette. So... I'm so thankful that uh, Carolyn sent that to me. That was so nice of you, Carolyn. Thank you so much. 
I will cherish this as always. Anything that um, I'm sent, I never get rid of. Lori at All That Beauty with Lori. She sent me this um, cargo, which is interesting. I've never had anything from cargo before. So she sent me this cargo uh, palette. It's called You Had Me at Aloha. <laughs> Instead of You Had Me at Hello. And look at this. Isn't this beautiful? This packaging. It's like so Hawaii. I don't know. Maybe we should ask Raynalyn whether or not this is so Hawaii or Bridge. Bridge, is this Hawaii? Look, the names of these shadows in here um, are, I think, things related to Hawaii. Now, of course, I've not used every shade in here, but the ones I have used, I really liked. So that would be Lei. Oh, I love that one. I love that one so much. Uh, Luau. I'm dying to use this, but I've not had a chance to yet. Um, Kapuna, at first I was like, eh, what a terrible shade. But you know what this shade is really good for? This shade is good for blending out a transition. So I really do like Kapuna. <laughs> is that what it's, how you say it? Um, it comes with, am I blinding you with that mirror? It comes with this nice brush. So it's kind of got a lot of it a little blender and a smudger kind of brush. Not really a smudger. I guess it's in between smudger and outer V kind of thing going on here. So it comes with this brush and I really like the creaminess of this black eyeliner that comes with it. So yes, thank you so much, Lori. I have been enjoying this. It was like her birthday month and she bought me a present. What a friend! <laughs> Thank you. Since we're on eyeshadows, let's just go ahead and talk about a couple of other things that I've been using and loving a lot this last month. Now, these were sent to me a few months back from one of my Fritzy family in Canada. Okay, so now uh, she told me in a note what, how you say this. <laughs> I think it's Poopa, Poopa, something, this brand. First of all, you get a generous amount. They're so soft, so buttery, and they go on and blend like a dream. So she sent me three of them. Uh, one was a taupe color. Uh, then we got this one, and it's more of a brown. You see, I mean, my gosh, these, and, and they go on with a brush as well as they swatch with your finger. So, you know, a lot of shadows, I'm not really impressed with a finger swatch. This one I, I truly love the most. So I'm not really that impressed with a finger swatch, big deal, but these actually do go on your lid with a brush that pigmented. I love these shadows. They're so beautiful. She didn't want to be mentioned, but she knows who she is, so thank you. And I thought you might like to know that I do use these. I have been enjoying them in the past month, especially. So the next few things I have been enjoying a lot this month, uh, one is a new purchase. The others are just things that I've had but rediscovered um, and went, oh, there you are. Why, why haven't I been using you? One of them would be this Lippy by Laura Mercier, and it is called, I actually reached for it because it's square and I didn't have my glasses on, and I thought from the look at it that it was my NARS Anna, and I grabbed it and put it on, but then it, I went, no, you aren't, but my gosh, you're beautiful. I forgot about you. Who are you? I want to introduce you to Laura Mercier Dolce de Leche. I love this lipstick. Doesn't this look wonderful? Yeah, I forgot how much I love this lipstick. So that I have been enjoying with almost every look that I've been putting together over the past month. Um, the next thing is I don't tend to reach for this so much. And I think it's because it's a collector's thing. It was part of a collection last spring. And so I put it away. I almost sold it on my website. I'm so glad I didn't. Normally I go for my Guerlain um, meteorites powders or I go for my hourglass ambient light powders so I don't tend to reach for my long comb Prezian shimmer cubes 
that's what I'm wearing, that's where the glow on my face is coming from today. Um, so I've been using these. I put them back out on the vanity so I would remember to use them. And yeah, look, she's got a cute little dog. that She's walking down the streets of Paris with her balloons. Oh, here we go. I was, I've been playing with the uh, mermaid powders that I got off of eBay. Um, these are a nail professionals product that I saw on this channel that I watched and when she linked to it, like so many other things that she links to, it's for professionals only, so I couldn't get it. And I'm like, just tell me I can't have something and watch what happens. I'll go get it. I'll find a way. So I went to eBay. Hashtag World's Games Driver. You're welcome. Okay, so I went to eBay and I got these powders, right? Now what they are is they're like glitter powders. Okay. And like this one here and my thumb, I just sprinkled a little bit of it on there before I did my top coat and uh, then cured it. So they're going nowhere for a while, but I just wanted to see by doing them all, which ones do I like the best? Which ones are pretty? So I obviously I have been enjoying <laughs> sandy glitter and nails in the month of June. Does not match what I have on, but you know, I'll get the drill out and drill it all off and repaint it something else later. But for now, I have been enjoying these. <laughs> Another rediscovered love is a brush that fell down and I couldn't find it, but this Sonia Kashuk brush, and I'll have it listed below because I have worn it off the ferrule, what it is, but this brush, I had forgotten when I got this, how much I love this brush for blending very quickly a transition. Really, you just go, it's done. <laughs> and I'm like, I forgot about you. Another thing that I love about these brushes is the ergonomic handles on them. They are so sleek and nice to hold in your hand. So this brush in particular I've been using a lot because I found it again to just quickly blend out the transition uh, from colors up here. So nice. It's perfect for that. This is the L'Oreal sponge. And I really like it. It was a lot smaller than this. I used it today, so it's it's dirty. Um, but it has, it gets so big and it's got a better feel to it than, I'm gonna say it, I like it better than my Beauty Blender. This is a really good one that I've been enjoying in the month of June. Okay then, so that wraps up my favorites for the month of June 2017. I hope that you enjoyed that. If you're not part of the Fritzy family, then please go ahead and consider hitting the subscription button below. We would love to have you here. And don't forget to ring my bell, ring my bell, so that you can be notified of every single video that I make when I make it. Okay then, if you're not having a blessed day, please go out and be a blessing to somebody else. And until next time, love you, see ya, bye, and I'm out. I wanted to tell you that today we're going to do yeah, something. I don't remember what, but we're gonna do something. Look, a bird. So, this is the favorites for July. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. It's June. I'm addicted. Uh, <laughs> the cap is even pretty on the thing, and there it went. <laughs> yeah, I can't tell you how many times I have stuck this in a cart, taken it out, stuck it in, stuck that, stuck it, stuck it, stuck it, stuck it. Just get out. Just stuck, 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 stuck. Stuck it. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta unwrap your tongue. And say, stuck. There we go. So, what are you doing? Really? What? Talking into your hands? I don't even know why I did that. <laughs> Be it light powders or my, um... Do, 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 do. I forgot what its name is. <laughs> um, this thing. And I like it going squishy, 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 squishy. You look like a pink macaroon. <laughs> I like this sponge a lot. Now, this one is, this is the contour one. I don't like this one so much. So, what the heck are you doing? This is not an empties you don't like stuff video. I'm sorry, baby, it hit you in the face. <laughs>